Rebecca too, I think. <laughs> uh, but when I'm older, I want to have lots of babies. Well, did Sarah tell you that Rebecca and I are going into business together? We've started our very own company. Mm -hmm. A company? How very conventional of you, do now. It's a women's only extreme sports club. And we'll run trips all over the country. Climbing, caving, skydiving, surfing. <laughs> There's a real market out there for women who don't want to deal with the bullshit that comes with a mixed group. What bullshit? Oh, you know the gear freaks, the ones that have to have the latest gadget and use it all the time. No room for instinct. <laughs> and then there is the peak baggers. And they don't care about where they are, it's just about whether they got to the top of the nest. <laughs> yeah, and the ones that have got to hold the map and be the leader and turn the whole thing into the fucking <laughs> army. <laughs> I want <laughs> them! I wonder who that is. Yeah. Okay. See, you just don't get that kind of bullshit with women. <laughs> <laughs> So you've been on trips with these guys before? Oh no, just once. Gina started them when she was at university back in England with Beth and Sarah. And then she started working professionally with Rebecca and they set up this over here. Why go on holidays with your sister? Well, technically she's my half sister. Which means we only see each other half as much as we should. <laughs> Bad joke. Oh, so you don't want to meet guys? I've got a guy. Oh, shows. Oh, he looks like a bad boy. I like it. <laughs> so have you done Borum Caverns before? Oh, I saw it in a book once. It's like Starbucks, you know? I oh, might as well have handrails in a fucking gift shop. It's for tourists, it's not adventure. If you're a caver, jumper, climber. Wow. <laughs> Next time, yeah, if you're gonna go, <coughs> smoke pot before a caving trip. Oh, what? Try sharing. Right, ladies! Group photo! How are you feeling? <laughs> it's so still, but don't tell Rebecca. Okay, come on. What's up with her? Looks like she's seen a ghost. It's fine. She broke down pretty badly after the crash. She's a mess. Couldn't find a reason to get up in the morning. Yeah, well, I guess she must have found one. Because she's here, right? Holly. Where's Sam? I don't know, she was here a minute ago. Sam? 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 Yeah. Sam? I'm busy. <laughs> I made her drink lots of water this morning. <laughs> I'll wait on you. I'm taking poison.
there so they can rig a line for you guys. I'll go. No. I'll go. No, I'll do it. Best to trip. No. Back home. Got a single case. I don't have experience. I do this. You see, your experience will take that all the way out of you. This is my job. Okay? All right, I've got three camps. I need at least three more. You see that crap running across the roof? Yeah, how did that happen? I go hand over hand. Put my hand in the crap, clench my fist, and hang on. Rebecca, you have done this before, haven't you? Oh, I saw a guy do it once. An instructor on an artificial wall over a block of crash mats. Josh, Sam. Uh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> so pretty soon they might be coming around the corner. What do you think? My uncle should be saying action. Thank you. 